Well, Megan, police tell me this all started around 6 o'clock tonight when a woman flagged down a police officer who was patrolling a couple blocks away on Main Street. She told that officer that she'd been held against her will here at this home in the 100 block of Iroquois. Now, police say there were several people inside when they arrived and were told they could search the home. Now, police tell me they found evidence corroborating that woman's story. And then to their surprise, they found a second kidnapping victim unconscious. That woman was taken to the hospital with non-life threatening injuries. According to police, the women knew someone in the home. They got in an argument and weren't allowed to leave. Now, police wouldn't say what kind of weapon, if any, was involved. Right now, police are interviewing witnesses and persons of interest, but have yet to make any arrests. Well, the detectives have a uh, uh, lengthy task ahead of them sorting out what actually happened. Uh, right now, they're gathering suspect information, and I would expect that they would have something uh, for our officers to look for. Uh, the witnesses, I'm sorry, the victims are cooperating, so uh, they will get some information for us to put out to our crews, and then we'll, uh, we'll seek them in the next couple days. Now, police tell me whoever is responsible will likely face charges of kidnapping or unlawful restraint. If you have any information, call Crime Stoppers at 222-7867. Reporting live in Dayton, Jackie Sprague, 2 News, working for you.